mostly looks like I'm in frame, at least a little. Anyway, this is my going to the bank look today. Oh, and I have to, to thank one of the, the drive-by insulters for the, the, you know, it does mean I get some interaction points for even rude comments. Yeah, they decided for some reason that I must obviously be pouting that somebody called me out for getting myself dressed up like this and putting my makeup on and being ugly. And that I was upset that somebody else is telling old women to do it another way. It took me a good half hour to stop laughing. Because this old woman does it because she wanted done it. So, how is everybody? I've been hanging out. I've got some chicken and white bean chili on the stove going bubble, bubble, bubble. Looks like I'm going to be going to a wound clinic, though. Being diabetic is a pain in the ass. And I ended up with a foot wound. Now, the last time I had a foot wound, it was immediately into surgery where they... relieved me of part of my left appendage. This time it's the right foot. So far, so good. It's like antibiotics and wound care. Yay! Anyway, I went a little different sort of kind of it's like I've got some dark greens some light greens some pinks something a little burply I figured I'd just go whole ham maybe I can get some more interaction from the grouchy child that told me I was fugly. Anyway, I'll take the interaction. It's good for my numbers. You know, it just works for me. You want to call me names and do that? You know, it's like, bring it on. Put it on there. And I'll look at it and laugh. Because, let's be real. If I was worried about what anybody else thought of the way I dress or the way I paint my face, I'd have stopped doing this a long time ago. I mean, and, and things like older women aren't supposed to show their arms. And it's like, the only thing about my arms that bothers me is the fact that I've lost so much weight that they look gnarly. <laughs> yes, I've been getting up to trouble. I've been to the thrift store again. I've got some more stuff to, to put together a haul. 
I've been dragging out all of my older palettes and going, let's go play. I drug out the half lashes that I picked up and put them on. I got this one a little off. It's a little farther in than this one. And that little farther in is bugging me a little. However, I didn't want to take it off and do it again. <laughs> it was not fun. I'm, my hands shake if I'm doing stuff. And trying to put eyelashes on with your hand shaking, it's like I usually hold the mirror with this hand. And after a very few minutes, my hand will start shaking to the point where I can't keep it still. I would have to hold the mirror with the other hand, you know, the other hand that's got the tweezers and the eyelash. And it gets to be really difficult. Now, I'm also going through some of my jewelry. I've got tons. I have collected jewelry for years. I am, I am an absolute collector of beautiful rhinestone pieces. The queens would love it. What I'm thinking about doing is sorting them out and putting them on Mercari or something. Maybe. I don't know which service I'd want to use. I know that I have arguments with Poshmark on occasion, but I want to get some wide reach. So I'm thinking Mercari. Anybody else has any good ideas, let me know. Anybody else who's crazy enough to want me to display them on here and we do a private sale, let me know. I'll tell people when certain things are coming up, like I've got an absolutely glorious rhinestone set where the stones look like tourmaline. It is gorgeous. Necklace and earrings. That one I think is going to go fast if it hits Mercari. So, like I said, if anybody's interested, Give me your opinions on which way would be the best way to do this. I would really like to, it's like I've got boxes, 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 boxes of jewelry that I couldn't wear in three lifetimes. I've got a lot of it that's absolutely gorgeous that I haven't been able to get to to wear because stuff is in the way. <laughs> Other jewelry. So I'm, yeah, definitely going to thin out the jewelry. Anything else going on with you guys? anything? Having fun? Anybody not having fun? Anybody want to get uppity and get in a challenge about using older palettes and using colors? regardless of whether or not somebody else thinks us old ladies shouldn't be using colors. Anyway, 
I know this isn't going to be a short one, but then I've got food on the stove. I just thought I'd show off the face and catch people up on a few things and then go back to cooking. That's what I'm going to do. I'm going to go back to cooking. I'll let you know how the, the chicken and white bean chili turned out. It's going to be yummy. It smells so good already. Oh well. There is no bail money. No really. I couldn't bail myself out. Be good to yourself. Be good to your neighbors. Be good to your family. Take care of yourself. Take care of your neighbors. It's hot out. Keep an eye on them. Check on your family. 